Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Donna Lee, and right off the bat, I'm gonna say sorry for the lighting, it's crappy, and I'm filming this with one hand. I figured I'd do a quick Dollar Tree haul and get this stuff put away. So why not turn on the camera and share with you guys? Uh, let's just get right into it. These are Lindauer Zings, I believe it's called. You get a four pack of them of uh, like sparkling apple juice. No sugar added or sweeteners, calories or preservatives. Kids already tried one and they just said it tastes like sparkling apple juice. And then I finally got my hands on these uh, margarita mixes. I got the strawberry and of course the classic. And you don't have to put alcohol in it. You can just put in um, like carbonated sparkling water or whatever you choose to put in it. And then I found these pomegranate juices. This is just the plain one. And then this one is the Super Berry Power Blast. And then back here we have the Life Waters. I thought the bottles were just so cute with the little tiger on it. And they have one with all the different color stripes. One of the kids already got into it, of course. And then my kids love hot stuff. So I found these Scorching Pringles. This is the Cheddar. And two and a half ounces. They're only like a half, like a, half a can. And they also had... The barbecue scorching. So let's see if they like those. And then for the smaller, for the littles, these Charms Mini Pops, it's a tropical mix. And they have Kiwi Kula, Pineapple Coconut, oops, and I dropped it because I'm filming with one hand, Mango Madness, Strawberry Starfruit, Citrus Splash, sorry for the glare, and Paradise Punch cute little sweets for the kids and I got them the gushers Lola also takes these in her lunches as well as snacks here at the house and I got these Goya Maria cookies I got the plain two plain and I got two chocolate I'm gonna be doing a recipe with those and I also have um a tub of cool whip which I forgot to take out of the freezer because I didn't want it to melt so I got one of those too. Found these Tapatio hot fries. Again, kids like hot. I figured they would want to try it. Ritz bites with uh, cheese instead of peanut butter. Lola can't take peanut butter to school. And then these are for me, the jumbo sunflower seeds. I love that with my Coke, watching my YouTube videos. And I'll call it a night. Muffin sticks. Now, I haven't seen too much of these hostess things, but I just noticed it like last week, I believe it was, when I saw it. They have like the cupcakes and the honey buns and everything. So I just grabbed those which got smushed. And the zingas. I used to love the raspberry ones when I was a kid. I don't really have much of a sweet tooth, even though I like bacon. I kind of switched up and I love sweet food. And then I found these strawberry hot shaped marshmallows for the kids thought that would be cute and then of course my gum finally found the kind that I like the spearmint that goes in my purse been on the hunt for these two it seems like I couldn't find them anywhere so I finally got them uh snow caps another one of my favorites so I grabbed a few of those for myself and a can of Rotel because I'm going to be doing like um a spicy kind of pasta not too spicy, but I'm going to do a recipe on that. Kids like funnel cakes. I have a funnel cake maker, so I grabbed two boxes of that so we could do that like on the weekends. Two more boxes of the instant mashed potatoes to fill up my canister. I use this when I make breads. If you want to see some more bread making videos, let me know. I'll be happy to film them. And then this is also another one of my favorites is the, uh, um, the cheese. <laughs> the cheese crackers I got I lost my concentration for a minute there the cheese crack is filled with the peanut butter here we go I believe I only remember seeing these in four packs if I'm not mistaken but this is six so I grabbed one of those and then as you guys know which I mentioned in yesterday's video I, I'm a spice fanatic I found this gourmet burger seasoning at Dollar Tree, so by Kelowna, I picked that one up, and I found the gourmet beer can chicken, which I've never made before, but I think I'm gonna attempt it on the grill, and I will definitely film that. 
garlic powder until I can go and get my other seasonings. I picked up one of those. And then the Kingsford lemon pepper. For some reason, I didn't have that one in my spices. Well, my Kingsford one. So I picked that up. And this is new to me. Um, so natural minced garlic and water. And this is eight ounces. So I grabbed one of those. And then this Pioneer Peppered Gravy Mix. They have like an onion, Swiss onion soup mix recipe on the back. I'm thinking about trying it. If you want to see me um, film this, let me know in the comments below. Because otherwise I have a copycat chilies recipe that is, was one of my favorites when we used to go there. I haven't been there in a while. But I make it at home for the price of one I could feed my whole family with. So if you want to see a recipe on my chilies copycat Leave a comment down below and let me know. Whoops, butterfingers today. And then I picked up this Coffee Mate Original. I'm also going to do a recipe with this, so stay tuned for that. And then I finally found the Valetti's Teriyaki uh, Marinade. So I grabbed two of those. I haven't tried it yet, but just in case I do like it and I can't find it anymore, I grabbed two. And then I grabbed another one of the Buffalo Hot Wing Sauce. And another one of the lemon peppers that I got in like my last Dollar Tree haul, I believe. And I found this um, Gaspar's taco sauce. It's mild. And this is 16 ounces. So I never seen that. So I grabbed that. And the label's coming off of this one. I've tried this. I made a pork ragu in the slow cooker in my crock pot. If you guys want to see a recipe on that, I'll be more than happy to film it. And I ended up using this garlic Valetti's uh, pasta sauce and it is so good. And of course, the one that I tried out of like the basil and then they have the marinara, which I have those two. Um, I use these in the recipe and they are so good. And I was only able to find one and two of the stores that I went to. So I snagged them right up. Also going to be doing a recipe with these hungry, hungry, hungry Jack hash browns. I bought these plenty of times and they're really good too, just to have for breakfast. But I'm going to do a video. Oh, this one snuck away over here. These are hazelnut um, cream filled, those little wafer rolls. Now I like the ones, I think it's preoline they're called in the metal cans. So I grabbed these to give a try. Yeah, let me see if I can... Oh, I got my hand in the way. Let me move it. My hand's getting tired. And then I found Kojak black beans. Um, also, uh, maybe I'll film it too when I make these black beans. And I do like a bean spread for these Milanesa, uh, steak Milanesa sandwiches. Definitely got to film that. I think you would like it. Now on to like kitchen and cleaning. I have, I already broke into these because I was filming my um, cooking video today, that which is going to be up tonight too. I love these throwaway mats. They're so good and they keep my cutting boards clean. And then I found this big, huge thing. It's 32 ounces of the soft soap liquid hand soap. But look at the top. It's different than like those round ones that we were finding. And which I think is still around. They have tons of them, but I love anything lemon too. Lemon scented, lemon flavored. That's just, I love it. Toilet bowl cleaner because I was out. And of course, my favorite sponges that I get all the time. And then I've never seen this before, so I grabbed it. The Scrub Buddies sponge scrubber. I think it's in the shape of a star. Really cute. So I grabbed that. Then of course, as usual... My flip ties spring scent I meant to grab the lemon, but that's okay. It's just a garbage bag. Dawn dish liquid. And Comet. I don't ever remember the Comet having um, a lemon set to it. I know they have like a lavender one, but for some reason I can't recall that. But I saw a lemon and I grabbed it. I love cleaning out my sinks with that, especially when I'm cooking with raw meats and everything. I always have to clean out my sinks. And I found these Glade, the watermelon sprays. And I found these Denta Guru. Denta Guru. <laughs> I cannot talk today, guys. Dental Guru charcoal toothbrushes. It's a cute, like, purple lavender and a pink. So I grabbed those. And then some breath strips just to throw in my purse. Two more of these. We had the Vicks, and I couldn't find any more when everybody was having sinus issues. 
So I got two of the natural mint oil Himalayan pink salt ones. I got that to restock back up in the medicine cabinet. And then I found these Dentec um, advanced repair kits. And I guess for like when you have um, fill-ins, like a loose fill-in or something, I just got it to have it in the medicine cabinet. And then also these bristle picks. I don't think you can see it in there, but it has like little tiny bristles on it that you, I guess you floss your teeth with. So grab that. And of course, more of the, cost, of course, more of this chest rub. I went through this when everybody was having their sinus problems. So I just grabbed another one and it's just as good as the Vicks Vapor Rub. And I think that takes care of all that stuff. Now we're going to move into like hair things, makeup and products like that. These are Electric Jungle Ioni Lashes. So they had a bunch of them, but I just picked out the ones that my daughter would like. These are the Light Cat Eye, which is like kind of thicker and longer. Natural Dial Medium and Round Volume. I just thought the packaging was so cute. I'm a sucker for packaging. And I found a 12 pack of combs, which I use for Lorelei's hair and Rosalie's, like when I'm getting Lola ready for school, when I want to do like space bonds or her little pigtails that she likes. And I'm always losing them. I don't know. They just disappear in this house. So I don't know if you can see it, but they're cute. They have little sparkles going through all of them. So I grabbed those. Oh, here's some more lashes. I found this Ardell pair, Whisper Soft, I guess they're called. Kind of thick. Sorry for the glare. And this I never heard of was Gypsy Lashes. I guess I accidentally picked up two of the same of the 900s in black. And then these are the 906s. And then I've hauled before like the mousse and hairspray of the... The Salon Graphics. This is the Blaze Leave-In Heat Protection Lotion and Primer. I do tend to straighten my hair a lot. And one of my older daughters does too. She has super, super curly hair. So I'm hoping this will like keep it tame. Because we both have curly hair. And even when I straighten it, it still tends to puff back up. And this is the Peacemaker Beachy Texture Spray. I love that beachy, wavy look too. And... I got this watermelon daily cleanser for your um for your face watermelon scent and I opened it up to smell it and it smells so good so of course I had to grab it and the littles get tangles a lot so I grabbed this watermelon spritz detangler for their hair and these all my eye makeup removers they had the smaller ones and I saw that they had the bigger one, so I grabbed another one of those because there's three girls here that like to wear makeup. Another pump is stone for the shower. More masks for the kids and for Lorelai. She still chooses to wear a mask in school even though she doesn't have to. Wipes for the kids. The 70, 72 pack of the Fisher Price Wipes fragrance free. And we already broke into these. These are the Hanes masks. It comes in a five pack. And these are so soft and breathable. If you find them and you still wear masks, I suggest you pick them up. They're very good. Now on to hair things. Of course, another obsession of mine. Got these for the kids and a couple for me. These say happy and love on them. They're just like the little alligator type clip thingies that you just clip in your hair. Happy and love. So I got two of those so I can have like a matching set on each side of the kids hair. And then Kiss and Baby. Probably wouldn't put those in the kids, the littles hair. But I just thought they were adorable and they are so shiny. So cute. And the little mini versions of the pearl barrettes. I got the square and the triangle shape. I picked these up for me like a tortoise shell. I do have the earrings too um, in this style. And I think I have the white ones too. I just think they're adorable and I just, I love barrettes. And then I found these hair clips that um, 
don't leave dents in your hair when you're putting your makeup on. I've seen these on Amazon too, and I always had them in my cart, but I'm not going to get them anymore because they're only $1.25. So I picked up two sets for me and the older girls. And then I thought this was cute for me, of course. This little hair clip is adorable. It's just like a little barrette and it has just like the little dangly pearls. So cute. And I picked these up for me. They had ones that had the pearl like right there at the tip. I didn't really care for that, but I found them without. So of course I had to get two. This adorable little um, scrunchie. And it's got this little gold thing with a little pearl hanging down. I just thought that would be so cute for like spring and summer. And also new to me, double pearl headband. I have tons and tons of headbands, so I'm just adding to my collection. And then this double gold one. I'm usually a silver girl, but I've really been getting into the gold lately. And then just cute little pink bows for the kids here. Now on to nail stuff. I found these uh, nailing. It's These are like all name brand. Little zebra print. I don't know if you can see it or not. Oh, this glare is horrible. I'm so sorry, guys. It's like little shiny diamondy effect in there. And then the girls like to do their nails. I thought these were absolutely adorable. Also in name brand. They have little hearts on them. Let me see if I can come up close. See how cute? Then I got these for me by B Color. I love the mauve colors in it and the floral, good for spring. So I grabbed everyone that I could find. Love animal print too. So again, with the pink and then the sparkly, it's like jelly. They call it like the jelly polish. I grabbed those. I also do um, my nails too, but I haven't been lately because I've been cleaning and everything else. But I also went to school for it, so I love it. Grab these like a cow print. It's kind of like a more, there's mauve and it looks like a dark chocolate brown. Grab those. Then I have the zebra ones that I found. And then this is just the blemish extractor. And they had these Maybelline fast gels, nail polishes. Which one is this one? I don't have my glasses on. Nude Thrill. It's just your basic creamy nude color. And this one is Sheer Fantasy. And I don't know if you can see that, but it has a little bit of sparkle in it. This one is Red Punch. Red is my favorite color, as well as pink. And this one is Caramel Crush. They also had a purple one too. I don't know why I didn't pick it up or maybe it fell out of the cot. But I grabbed those. I also have like a humongous nail polish collection. The Maybelline lipsticks that were out, I didn't have this one. So I grabbed it and I already opened it. I love nude colors. So that's that. Then I got the Jade Gua Sha Massager. Gua Sha, right? I think that's how you say it. By Be Pure. My daughter stole my other one. So I grabbed another one. And then these CoverGirl Clean Fresh. Um, illuminators. This one is So Guilty. I grabbed that one. Opal Dreams and Pink Thrill. I thought the girls would like that too. Then I found uh, some clearance things too. I found this cake top that says love and I like to bake a lot too. It was only 50 cents so why not? I grabbed it. And this contact case was only 50 cents. All eyes. I don't wear contacts. I wear glasses, but I put my pills in those. And then I also found this Ardell um, eyebrow. It's supposed to be like make your eyebrows look fuller. The package completely broke. So it came like that and with a little spoolie. Allison wanted uh, this coconut rule on gloss they had like the one in the clear packaging i don't know if this is if they renewed it or what but grab that for her and i also found a heated eyelash curl or comb kind of a little iffy on this but i don't know we'll try it. it's by b color too it takes one triple a battery and also in the clearance i found these cute little bunny feet i'm going to set them up to the girls easter baskets so when they wake up in the morning they'll get directed like right towards their baskets. 
which I did get stuff for that. I'll if you want to see a video on it, I'll show you like what's in the girls' Easter baskets. And then I found a fitted tee, a ladies' fitted tee. I like to wear these after I get um, Lorelai on the bus. I like to go walk in afterwards. Oh, did you hear that ping? That's my cannon jaws. All right, so that ends for that section. And then I got these citronella incense sticks. They're pretty long. I'm going to be setting up my canopy soon. So I got these for when we sit outside. I love to sit outside. And oh, back here too. I got these four. There was only four left of the smaller size of these jars. I'm sure you've seen the bigger ones everywhere. I, let me see if I can hold this with this hand and show you. I love them. Every time I see them, I grab them because I just think they make everything so neat and clean. Like this one here, for instance, I have my coconut flakes in. And I have probably have about 10 to 12 of these right now. And I will grab more if I see them because I just love putting all my pantry staples inside of them. It's just so neat and organized. And then back to the outside stuff. I got some seeds I like to garden every season. So I grab these peppers. The, it's a Grand Bell mix. Grab those seeds. Lavender. Parsley. Dill. Carrot. Chives. Summer squash. Thyme. Basil. Watermelon and habanero peppers, oregano, sage. I like to do these inside the house, the, the herbs. Serrano chili peppers, cucumbers, and spinach. I found this herb rocket, it's dill, and I also found a tomato one, which I kind of crushed. So I get that, and then I found this cherry tomato grow kit. It was only one. The package is already coming undone, but I had to have it. And a basil one. And I might start one and give it to my neighbor. We got new neighbors. And I just thought this was adorable. It's just like a big, huge light bulb, and you put your plant inside there. So I grabbed that. And then they only had two of this color, which I want more, but I have to have this just plain basic color of the the three sectional pots that you stack on top of each other. I only found one of the window ones so I could do my herbs. I usually, for the most part, get good light coming in through the kitchen window and that's where I'm gonna set them. And just one bag of soil in there so it doesn't make a mess. And this butterfly car freshener smells so good. I already opened one and he has another one. Then I have a plant hanger like that macrame style that's going to go outside in the canopy and i already opened these for my house plants to feed them i've never had a problem with these before i've used them last year and i grabbed two packs of these black hangers because that's one thing i can't stand is having mix match hangers in the closet and i recently got some new purchases so i needed more hangers and i'm probably going to need more too but for now this will work and I think that's going to complete this haul okay I'm going to wrap it up here don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you're notified every time that I upload a video sorry about my fingers again and I might pop back on I went to Ocean State job lot let me know if you'd like to see a haul on that too I got I didn't get too too much but I found some interesting things there and also I went to Savers and a little bit of Salvation Army too I went thrifting with my mom yesterday so if you'd like to see a haul on that I got quite a bit of goodies there so leave a comment down below and let me know if you'd like to see any of the stuff that I had mentioned and I'll see you in the next one bye